so here is another route through which uh, students can get admission directly to the bs in data science and applications program of iit madras so the first was where if you're not a je candidate or maybe you've done je uh, many years before you have to come through the qualifier process so you apply and do the one month and then do the process i described earlier but if you are a candidate who has qualified to jee advanced in 2023 or 2024 then you can apply to us giving proof of that being eligible for the jee advanced by which when we check it we will say it is approved and you can directly start the foundation level of the bs program so the steps involved in this are first step fill the application form okay and there there will be a category which asks saying that are you coming through the je advanced route and please note this year's may 2024 admission is only eligible for candidates who became eligible for the je advanced 2023 or the current year je advanced 2024 if you are from je advanced 2022 or 21 that will not be considered you have to come in through the qualifier route so you fill the application form select the je advanced option you upload the proof of anything that you qualify to the je advanced there must be some notification that you got you have to upload that as part of the form and then you pay the admission fee of rupees 3000 now for this rupees 3000 we will go through your application we will verify your documents we will verify your je proof that you have given us and if the proof is valid we will approve saying that you have you are deemed to be qualified to enter the program and you can start directly with the foundation level the process here only admits you to the program it does not give you access to the content if you want access to the content and start the program you have to register to the courses many students who come through the je category assume that having paid the 3000 rupees they will get access to the content the 3000 rupees for je students is only an admission fee into the program that we say that you are admitted but you have to register to courses and start the program with us so there will be a window in which you register you can choose between one or two or three or four of the first four basic courses like i said english one maths one stats one and computational thinking and you can start the coursework by may 31st when the term starts okay so only after you register to courses will you get access to content and thereafter you can start the program as a regular student you can pursue this program even as you join another college or another degree because now it is permitted to pursue two degrees at the same time so if you're a je 2024 student who has qualified you're waiting for college admission still you can still do the may term with us september term with us and continue to do the program with us as you wait for admissions as you get admitted to a college and pursue another degree to uh, for those who do not qualify after the first two weeks when we take out the average of the first two weeks graded assignments if the average does not cross more than 40 out of 100 or as per your category cut off we then have another option where we will consider the best two out of the first three weeks of graded assignments and see whether you qualify in that so maybe you have not done so well in your week 1 and week 2 but you have a chance to make it up in week 3 graded assignment submission so you can put in more effort you can try to uh, cross the cut off by using the week 3 at this point in time so at the end of week 2 we say who all are eligible to write the exam on july 7th then there is week 3 that's going to come out then we take the best two out of the first three weeks and in that if you qualify you can write the qualifier exam on august 4th so this is the way that uh, students in the qualifier process will get two chances based on whether they qualify at the end of week 3 so in that case the dates will be july 7th for the first set and august 4th for the second set